All right, today we got Super Mario All-Stars for the SNES. Wanted to get this video out early because we just heard about the release Nintendo is planning within a week, Super Mario All-Stars 3D. This is gonna be really exciting. I don't even own a Nintendo Switch, but definitely buying one for that game. This one has all of the original NES versions including the Lost Levels. Really excited to play that one because it was only released in Japan. They said it was too difficult for the North American market. Let's get on to the box art here. You got the logo up there. A bunch of the characters right here with the mean looking Bowser cloud in the background. Pretty cool stuff. You got the one, two, three and the Lost Levels, all the games included there. And you got Mario in a top hat here. Magician wand, pretty cool stuff. And here's the back. You got four screenshots, looks to be one of each game included. Here's a description. It's the greatest collection of Mario games under one roof. Well, maybe not anymore. Battery backed memory saves up to four players progress. I like that because the original NES, you couldn't save most of these games. So you have to sit down and beat it in one go. You need a lot, a lot of time to finish those games. Here's the instruction manual. Go through this real quick here. So we got Super Mario Bros and the Lost Levels. Here's the story. Controls and characters, items, look at that. Very descriptive. Super Mario Bros 2, I like how they have the stories. I actually don't know if I've ever read them, so maybe after this video I'll go through them. Super Mario Bros. 3, definitely the greatest one in the franchise. You can uh, say what you want to say, it is the, definitely is the bit, best Super Mario Bros. to ever be released. Just so many cool levels, awesome open world concept, and two player, you can't beat that. Onto the cartridge here. Slide that guy off. Same artwork, standard gray cartridge. I didn't unscrew it yet. So we'll do that real quick here. Get it this way. And there you have it. Circuit board for Super Mario All Stars. Let's get into a quick review. All right, so we got Super Mario All-Stars in here. Look at this, love this intro screen. Great tunes. Let's get into it. Okay, so it just looks like a basic emulator here. You got Super Mario Bros. 1, The Lost Levels, Super Mario Bros. 2, and 3. So we'll just start with the first one here and go in order. Play one or two of each game and call it a day. Here we go. Look at these graphics too. Updated graphics. Damn. They really outdone themselves here. Outdone themselves. Let's go. Here we go. Man, a little rusty in this game, but I know about all the secrets. Look at this. Give me that star power, you know what I'm saying? Then we'll just crush through level here. And that should just about do it. Perfect landing. Crush that first level, no problem. Wow. This looks like a, a SNES game. This could be a SNES game, no problem. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Oh man. Tunes, man. This is probably my favorite track from the original game. It's this underground theme. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeehaw! Can you go down one of these? It's been ages since I played this game. Not doing too too bad though, considering. You always want to go zone three, boys and girls. All right, so we're on to the lost levels now. Very excited about this more difficult version of Super Mario Bros. Oh, look at this. Already throwing one of those bouncers at me. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, shit. Got 
that out. I really want that. Give me that. Yes. Love it. Yeah, it's way more difficult for sure. You can just tell the enemies they're throwing at you. But more or less, it seems like pretty much the same game here. Holy smokes. This is a nutty game. Whoa! No! Alright. Very difficult. Uh, you know, we're gonna just call it quits there. Get right on to Super Mario Bros. 2. Super Mario Bros. 2. Definitely an interesting game, you know. It's one of those you love it or you hate it. Personally, I grew up with this game. So I absolutely love this game. This up and down, more vertical um, platforming was definitely a nice change of pace. The graphics were just really good for an NES game. How do you pick up? There's a pick up button, no? Aha! Boom! Love that. I have no idea what I'm doing, guys, so... Please don't get too upset with my gameplay right now. These guys troll you pretty good. Damn. Ah, okay, I'm dead. We'll call it quits there. All right, on the Super Mario Bros. 3 here. One of my all-time favorites. Bum ba bum bum ba dum bum ba dum bum ba dum bum ba da bum. Oh, this tune brings back so many memories. Just wasting so many hours as a kid playing this thing. Here we go. Love it. Ba dum bum. There's so much cool stuff. I think he, there's like a glitch. You, you could go beneath this thing talk about new abilities look at this the raccoon suit and spin and hit guys you can fly with this oh okay now you can fly here we go look at this so cool welcome to super mario bros 3 in style and it, this is actually really amazing on the Super Mario All-Stars, so... Got the star. Super Mario All-Stars on a whole. Just an unreal, unreal package of games. Four amazing games. You could spend hours and hours playing these games. Especially two-player with a friend. They just knocked it out of the ballpark with this game. Everything about it is improved. It's perfect, so... Hope you guys get a copy, try it out, and we're looking forward to the 3D All-Stars coming out soon. Thanks for tuning in. Please subscribe. See you next time.